I'm free today, yay, it's so weird. I'm just gonna go to the shop now, literally the one, the tiny one at the end of our road to get um, bread and like the essentials for just today. Cause we're gonna go to like Aldi in the middle and do a huge shop tomorrow. Cause we need so much, like we've obviously gone through everything that we had in the last like week that we've been isolating. So yeah, and we've so much stuff that we haven't got yet. Cause we obviously have only just moved in so. We're gonna do that tomorrow, so I'm just gonna go get like bread, we've no bread, like butter, treats for later, um, and like something to go with the pasta that we have for dinner. But um, nothing, like nothing, really nothing interesting. So yeah, I'm literally walking down to there, and Connor's having a shower, and then we'll have breakfast up and back. And then, I don't really know what I'm doing today. I don't have a plan for today yet. Right off I go. It's raining, are you actually serious? Like, you've got to be kidding me. I don't think you can see it, but oh my god, for fuck's sake. No. I'm free. Gourmet breakfast. It's a new location, a new crew, a low deck. Adventure. Just in my car now, heading to Tesco, and it's literally one minute to five, and I. There's raindrops reflecting on my head, and I literally. Oh, it feels like it's so like late it's pitch dark out because it's raining i was gonna walk to the shop like all afternoon i was thinking about it and then i was like nah because like fuck it just the weather basically i was like fuck it so there's a few other bits that we need we need something for dinner i wasn't able to really get them in the little shop that i went to so and like we could survive without them but then we had no milk left and that was like the final straw for me to get me so i was like ah oh, fuck it i kind of want to just get out of the house as well if you get me so yeah i'm gonna go to tesco uh which is like a five minute drive so i'm gonna do that now I'm freezing i need the hot air on Hiya. um yeah actually if you don't mind There's a lot of colors I don't know where to go See a lot of colors Only feeling blue There's a lot of colors Lost within a haze Don't rely on the That's why it's on. I think I fucked up my pattern somehow, but... The dreams are not the same for me Standing. Hey guys, welcome to, welcome back to the vlog. Good morning, it is the 4th of January, so me and Connor are about free today we're finished isolation and we both feel fine so we're heading out for a walk now i'm so out of breath after just walking up the stairs this walk's gonna be tough but anyway i'm looking forward to it because i went for a walk yesterday but i was by myself it's just way more fun when connie's with me because i don't even know like my way around here that well so yeah it's much better so anyway i'm gonna grab a mask just in case i need it and blow my nose and then we're gonna go because I literally I can't breathe like honestly I'm so blocked up still we're free Drowning in the sea There's too many voices Talking back at me There are a lot of choices We 
are going. Khan's ancient old man radio. It's actually the worst. Like we're going to Aldi, possibly Tesco as well if we have to, because we need to buy so much food. We literally need everything. Um so yeah, we forgot the shopping bags, so Con's just running to get them now because we're not very experienced at grocery shopping yet. So every single time we forget bags. Yesterday when I went to the shop I had one under my arm. Somehow I managed to put it down and forget it. So then I got there and I was like, hey. What you have on your list? Now we're in Tesco. Now to put the wretched stuff away. Ugh. Collecting our big fat shipper. Now it's time to do turn down. If you watch below deck, you'll know. Good morning. Welcome. Oh my god, my hair is so greasy and disgusting and I literally washed it yesterday. So annoying. Anyway, I'm gonna try and make something different for breakfast now. I just saw it on um some girl who does like Slim Worlds and stuff. She has like lots of good recipes. I'll link it below if I um I can find it, but it's just like baked oats. So we got like, I think it's just like three eggs. This is like between the two of us, so three eggs, um, porridge oats, yogurt, which we have, a vanilla, which I think will be nice. And then I'm gonna do blueberries. So you do like, um, you do like a, whatever fruit you want, but we've got frozen blueberries. I think they'd be nice. We have some berries as well, so maybe I'll split them and I'll see how I feel. And then you like mix it all up, I'll show you. And then it ends up like a little like baked oats thing, but meant to taste like a muffin or something like that kind of. So I think I'll just do that. I only have like a bread tin, so I think I'll just make it like a loaf of bread and like cut it in half. And we'll have like half each. So wish me luck because I'm not too good at this kind of thing. Our appliances are all coming today we ordered them like five days ago and we're just getting them delivered because we were going to go into the store but obviously then we both had covid and that didn't happen we literally were planning on going on Stephen's to stay now it's the 5th of january we haven't got them yet but i think it's actually easier and better because we're getting such big appliances like we need like we're not going to probably fit them in the car they might have fit maybe or maybe in the two of our cars but also like we don't know if we'll be able to install a washing machine and a dryer and a dishwasher ourselves so you can like pay them to do it on the day so we've booked in for them to do at least the washing machine but at least they like know what they're doing the guys who deliver it so they like if we are like it's a dishwasher complicated to do like we can ask him to do it first thing it's like 30 quid per appliance or something but if he's like yeah that's crazy to be able to do that yourself then we can just you know we can have them like all installed today so it's good the other free was like 25 euro and we still managed to get a discount because they do like a discount if you're buying loads of appliances there so i think they knocked probably like around 20 30 euro off most of the appliances and um, as a discount because we were buying so many so we bought a washing machine a dryer and they're actually gorgeous they're like they're like black and you know the new washing machines and dryers look so nice like they look like fucking spaceships they're so nice <laughs> compared to what they were um, and then we got a dishwasher that's gonna go in here um the dishwasher is like a stainless steel like dark gray i think 
Um, and then I feel like we had too much black to get me. Um, so yeah, then the dishwasher, the washing machines are gonna go in the like utility slash bathroom out the back. And then we also got, you know, like a toasty machine that you like open up. Um, what are they even called? No, they're like a panini machine as well, but you can do like toasties, wraps, whatever. We got one of them. We got a um. Oh my god, we got a new Hoover. We got a shark. I'm so excited. It was reduced to like 250 from like fucking 400. And then we got um. Oh. Oh my god, what do they call? I can't think. Oh, we got an air fryer. And it looks like a really good one. It looks really big as well, so very excited because I actually use them all the time when I'm at home. And then what else do we get? Microwave. Someone actually bought us a toaster, the toaster that I bought the ages, so I'm really excited about that. I don't know who did, but someone in my family did because my mum was like, don't buy a toaster. <laughs> so we know that's on the way. And then I think that's it. So for some before and after the dishwasher is gonna go there. Excuse the kitchen, it's a bit messy. <laughs> These are from IKEA by the way. I've got a lot of questions in my story, so in case you're wondering, I need to get more Oreos for there. Um and yeah, I think that's all that's going in here. Except for yeah, the rest will just be like I don't know where we're gonna store half of it, but anyway, we'll cross that bridge. Um and then this is the like bathroom made here, I fucking hate the toilet and the sink, but we move, it's still handy to have and we actually use it a good bit. So we're gonna put the washing machine and dryer there. Well, not in that order, I don't know. <laughs> but um, actually, yeah, now I think the dryer has to go there because the water thingy would you grease there. So yeah, this is like the utility, like that's how I'm treating it, but in an ideal world, we'd rather have them separate if we're extending out the kitchen which we're hoping to do so in here we're literally just wearing toilet paper you kind of bought the biggest fucking packet over yesterday and the fucking most expensive packet as well there's even more up there because he was like i just i need a nice quality toilet paper i was like all right knock yourself out so then this actually corrects me up like for fuck's sake but anyway um so yeah in here we have all the like washing stuff that we need on the tea side but yeah because we obviously have my washing machine and dryer and then up here is like just cleaning stuff and like just stuff that like we can't fit where it's meant to go so we're just keeping it there it's like an extra fucking just choice we bought so many like my wadi drinks <laughs> thinking like I could use for Christmas but anyway it was still so nice and um, they make the same winter edition for the version of Breeze and a bleach. They're just in here because there's not enough space for them anywhere else. So yeah this room's gonna look hopefully way better with them in here because you won't see all that shit. Um, and yeah like I obviously want to change this anyway but it's last on my list to be honest. Like I could do with a paint like I don't know how or who painted this house but it's so badly done like it's like everywhere they've got it everywhere kills me and like look at that like are you okay like are you actually all right fucking hell Ooh, it kills me anyway it's time to make breakfast getting kind of cold and everything needing okay so here's the ingredients three eggs some vanilla flavored yogurt it's from aldi Actually, these are literally all from Aldi. <laughs> um, then I have just sweetener. Because I think she had like vanilla essence or something like that. I think if she had lemon essence would be so nice. But I don't have any of that. So I'm just going to use a bit of sweetener. Um, there's blueberries. And there's some more fruit just in case I decide to put it in. And then porridge oats. And then this just to grease the tin thing. I hope it's like the right amount for that. So I'm just actually going to mix these all up now with 
this and then put it into this and into the oven for 30 minutes. I should better turn on the oven. Okay, we're ready to go. <laughs> How good all fits in this? Yeah, that microwave's gorgeous, isn't it? Yeah, sweet. The TV is actually very big. <laughs> Sorry? The TV is actually very big. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Thank God we didn't get any bigger, honestly. Here is the washing machine and dryer. This is the dryer. And this is the washing machine. It's such a hassle to get the dryer in because they put in the washing machine first, but we're here now. First wash just went on. Woohoo! Very excited. So sleek and fancy. I love. They're both gorgeous, like actually gorgeous. How can I find a washing machine or dryer gorgeous? Like, what's wrong with me? I think I'm broken. The name of the washing machine is. Er, that's absolutely not a washing machine. The microwave is out. We were gonna go for a different one and then they didn't have it. So we went for this one and it looks really similar. I think the other one was more like dark grey rather than black, but the black goes really well with all of our black bits over there. And then this is like dark greyish silver for a change. I just thought it would look nice with the oven and stuff. Um, and obviously our sink is still like that at the moment as well. Who knows, it might change. <laughs> I'm hoping so, but um, anyway, yeah, I'm really happy. This is really like nice and slick as well. I do not know how you turn it on. Oh. But it's very fancy. So, they really make the kitchen look a lot nicer, like it's crazy. So then, we also got this like sandwich and panini toaster, like a just grill thing, I guess. Um, Where's the box? Look at all our packaging. Bye! Literally can't wait to bring them to the recycling tomorrow. But um, yes, yeah, so that's it. It's just panini grill and griddle. And yeah, I fucking love a panini or a wrap or a bagel on these. So, like, we literally need it when I missed it so much. So, yeah, then the last thing to take out is the um, air fryer. It's a really big one. 
4.2 liter and it was more expensive than a lot of them I think it was like 80 before any discounts that we got actually I don't think we got any discounts on this but um yeah no it looks like a really nice one and hopefully it'll be good it'll last so yeah it's also great to be able to like fuck everything into it and cook everything in it because they're so handy I used my one at home all the time my mum and dad so be fab yeah, those fried are delicious. Yeah, they're literally sweeter than the real ones, aren't they? Much nicer, or something like that. It felt like we deserved an Indian, but this looks way too tomatoey. Oh, so it's nice. It's the lights for me. 